Yeah. Wow. This intro has been incredibly difficult for me to try and record. But let's see if we can do it this time. What is going on, everybody? It's Net Neptunimus here. Thank you all so much for joining me here in this special episode of Resident Evil 3 Nemesis. This is an incredibly special game to me, and actually the whole Resident Evil series is incredibly dear to my heart. I, I grew up playing it with my best friend. We... We spent hours and hours scouring these games and doing all kinds of crazy stuff. Um, and that actually leads us to today. So, where have I been? Uh, I have been on an uh, incredibly rough, incredibly enlightening uh, mental health journey these extended absence months, absent month, whatever. Um, and unfortunately, a few weeks ago, one of the worst things ever happened to me uh my best friend of 25 years was unfortunately <clears throat> hit and killed by a dui hit and run um so that has been incredibly difficult these past few months or past few weeks i'm sorry because he just passed away a few weeks ago um but again that leads us to today this game and this specific date so the day of this recording it's actually september 28th um so it's been a long time since i've played resident evil 3 and this is actually my first remake run that i've ever done I, I know this game is different from the original, and that's perfectly fine, but this is kind of more or less a tribute to my fallen buddy. So, let's get on with things. Um, yeah, let's... Let's see what Resident Evil 3 has in store. Uh, new game, standard. Here we go. This pandemic has spread faster than any disease in modern history. Authorities are bracing for more rioting tonight. He was knocked unconscious. Uh-huh. A city-wide emergency has been declared. CDC has quarantined the lower Midwestern region of the U.S. Officials can't say. Commitment, honesty, integrity. These are the core values that create the foundation for all of us. Uh-huh. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's totally what Umbrella it's wants to do. That will continue to build a brighter future for all of us. Uh go on. Uh 
Hey, buddy. It's been a while. It's been a long time, Nemesis. Let's go, buddy. Let's go. Oh, man. The memories. Come on. Come on. Get up. Get up. Get up. Man, it's so weird playing three from the perspective of the seven. Because I haven't played eight yet. I know, I know, it's been out for years. Ah, uh, I know. Bite me. Arr. All right. Let's see. Oh, man. All right, all right. Why? You know, this bathroom looks oddly... Uh, maybe not. Alright. I'm just gonna say, kind of reminding me of the PS4 demo of PT. Uh, uh, Jill, you got, you got a little something on your face. Man, you need to use some lotion. Yeah, you don't, uh, you don't look so good. You've been, uh, spending too much time in the Spencer Mansion. Oh, yeah. I mean, that'll settle it. Suicide is not the answer, by the way. Just throwing that out there. Gets worse every night. I know, I know, I know. Three more days, then I can kiss this town goodbye. September 28th. Bah, bah, bah. Swap! What do we got? What do we. Ooh, Stars Team. September 26th, 1998. It's already been two months since that mess with Umbrella. Thanks to the suspension, investigations haven't progressed exactly as I had hoped. Perhaps this written record of what I found will prove to be my final duty as a STARS officer. Wow. I can only hope that it helps to lead to the truth. The T-Virus. Those infected by the virus seem to become literal zombies. It appears to be communicable via several different avenues outlined below. Bite from an in infected individual allowing the mixing of bodily fluids. Contact with crows which have eaten an infected carrion. Due to the strength of the virus, airborne cannot be discounted. Uh huh. It should be noted that those who survived the incident have not yet developed symptoms. It is unclear whether this is because the virus has a long incubation period. Wow. Or just because we just happen to be resistant to the infection. We ought to remain vigilant even after this investigation period ends. 
Wow. As for me, uh, aside from a minor difficulty sleeping, I seem to be in fine shape. Still, I haven't got too hopeful. After all, this could just be an extended incubation. Wow, that was way too difficult. And I don't know why. Umbrella. Pharmaceuticals company industry leader in market share. Focuses on military weapons development while maintaining cover as a pharmaceutical company. Also secretly developing bioweapons. The TU virus outbreak at Arclay Mountains Research Facility. Predicted to be the mansion incident. Conspiring with the Raccoon City readership, large donations to Mayor Warren's office effectively controls the city. Nothing. Ooh, what do we got? Too many pills. Yeah, but you gotta take care of yourself. Yeah, clickety click, clickety click. No, 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 no. Okay. Clickety click. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't, I can't read these, um, for some reason it's, I'm having a hard time trying to, uh, keep my composure while I play some old memories and hopefully make some new ones. Please collect. Clickety clickety clack. What do you want? What's in the fridge? You got anything to eat? No? Alright. Man. Alright, I'm coming. You know what? Brad Vickers! No. Mm-hmm. Yep, you can wait. It's just gonna keep ran. I know. I know, right? Damn. Hello? Jill! Are you, are you okay? Brad, is that you? Oh, Listen, eh. you gotta get out of there. What are you talking about? I don't have time to explain. You gotta get out of there right now. Alright, let me grab my stars. That's gotta hurt. Um. Uh huh. What the hell is that thing? Uh, that's Nemesis. He really wants to be your friend, Jill. He is very bad for your health. Let's go. Come on. Any, any, any. Uh, no time. Uh oh. 
What? Oh, yeah. Uh, run away! What? 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 Not... Alright. Well... Okay. Yeah, that was a, th a thing. Damn. What the... Man, you gotta bust a ribbon on that. Okay. Run, run, run. Oh my god. What? What is this? <laughs> what is that? All right. That was, uh, interesting to say the least. I mean, that's, that's kind of what, that's kind of what I'm saying. Why can't I, I don't want to stay on the wall. Okay. How do you, how do you, how do you stuff in things, Jill? Huh? What do you, uh, uh. Oh, come on. Jill? Over here. Oh, God, Brad. You okay? No, Brad. Damn if I know. But right now it's got a hard on for the only two stars left in town. You and me. Got some bad news for you, buddy. Just look around. He's about to be one of us. The more screwed we are. Especially when you're involved, Brad. Ah, they didn't hide any green herbs down here. Can I get into here? What? Oh my goodness, Brad. Now I can run. What is this for? Oh. Oh, you're in deep, deep co- oh, was No, no, inventory was my in- Ah. You're running like you're in deep red caution. Brad! 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 Here! Brad! 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 Yeah, it's the zombie apocalypse. What? 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 Nom 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 nom. You'll be fine. Rub some dirt in it. No, I don't. Are we still a team? Always. Then do me a favor. Don't fuck up like I do. Go! Told you so. Now. Can we... What? Oh, you can't... In the original... Uh, you can go back in there. And sometimes there would be a zombie bread. You know what? I instantly regret doing that. Ah! Oh, it's auto squat. Okay. That sounds like a terrible idea. Oh, this dude. Dude goes crazy. Isn't far. 
Uh huh. In the original, you could, I believe, you start in that room. It's a safe room, and yeah, Sir, what's your name? who gets angry? His daughter died. I know, right? Thanks. Go handcuff yourself to one of those freaks. Bro, that's not good. That's not cool. This is your last chance. No one else is coming for you. I'm not going anywhere. I'd rather start to death than here to be eaten by one of those undead monsters. Now leave me alone. Oh, I get them. I think they changed his dialogue. Dags aren't fun to play with. Bah! Poke you in the eye. Be kind of funny. <laughs> Just walk by. Boop. You got anything good in there? No. Parking girl. Man. Played a pretty crucial vote. Ah, whoa! Was not expecting you for some reason. That's what I'm saying. Action roll. Whoa! Oh, you bastard. Get out of me. I don't want to waste my ammo. I don't want to waste the ammo. Go away. So, how are you doing today? I hope you're having a great day and a great night, wherever you are. Rooftop! Uh huh. Yep, yep, yep. I will be right there, dude. Let me uh, <clears throat> look for some ammo. So sick of you blowing up my helicopters. That's all you do. Why can't we just talk? Sorry. Don't be sorry. I don't understand what this is exactly supposed to accomplish. Uh, that's half how physics work. You didn't have a seatbelt on. Okay, that's a thing. All right, then. Uh, uh. There's my buddy. I don't, I don't, what is this? 
stars. Carlos? What the f- hey, easy, mate. I got you. Who are you? What are you doing? Carlos. I'm saving you. Come on. Let's get you someplace safe. Oh, man. What? I- I think we're in the clear. Oh, uh, okay. Hope Why so. is Carlos here? We've been bringing survivors here. Here where? My guys have converted some subway cars into a shelter. Uh huh. I'm fine. Personal space, okay? Don't touch me, bruh. Let's go. Oh come on! Who's the dipshit to close this? I don't want to hang out with Carlos. I want to go punch Nemesis in the face. Nemesis. Nothing. I've never seen anything like it. But it's no zombie. It knows what it wants and won't stop till it gets it. Don't you like that, in a man? No thanks. He's all yours. What is Listen, I promise you're in good hands. I'm with the Umbrella Biohazard Countermeasure Service. Uh -huh. BCS for short. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? You guys are the ones who caused all of this. Whoa, whoa, That's what I'm saying. What are you talking about? You don't have to trust me, but I'm going to the shelter. You coming? Come on. It's this way. Did you just Man. I I was told it was different, but this is insane. Why are we meeting Nikolai and Mikhail now? Hey, Captain. This fine young lady could use our help. Carlos, you didn't even think to ask fine young lady your name? She is an elite operative of RPD, Special Tactics and Rescue Service. Yes, I am. Her name is something Valentine. It's Jill. Remember it. Nice to meet you, Jill. I am UBCS, Platoon Leader Mikhail Victor. My team uh -huh. is sent here to rescue civilians. Go on. Right. How's that going for you? The city is completely cut off, isolated. Yep. Most of the hundred thousand civilians will wind up dead. Uh, correction, undead. My platoon has suffered serious losses. Okay. Just keeping them alive is more than I can manage. Well, yep. you can thank your corporate overlords for that. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get this subway train moving, we can evacuate some survivors. But we need help. My men cannot do this alone. All right. I'm in. But why? Not yours. Oh, hey. It's cool. We all want the same thing. Thank you, Jill. All right, super cop. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. I know what a radio is. Chabra. First things first. We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. All right. All right, everybody. That will go ahead and wrap up this episode. Um, thank you all once again for sticking with me these past absent months. 
Um, and even watching this incredibly special tribute to my best friend, um, I appreciate it. And I, like I said, I am hoping to be able to get back into the swing of things and start uploading again. So thank you all so much. And I will catch you in the next one.